I replaced my Philips fluorescent bulbs 40 watts T12 with two new one but now the lights won't turn on. How long have you had your T12? Years. What have you tried so far with your T12? So far, I've twisted them in, lights off, rotation one way and then the other. No go. I then flip the bulbs to change the ends and try it again. No go. These are brand new bulbs and I basically watched the old ones go out last night. Anything else you want the electronics expert to know before I connect you? Is it ballast or bulbs? Hello. Welcome to Just Answer. My name is I will be assisting you. Please note that you may see an offer for a phone consultation, for an additional fee. This offer is automatically generated by the website, and does not originate from me. You can disregard it, unless you would like a phone consultation. I'm sorry to hear you are having problems with your fluorescent light. You are on the right track. When installing new bulbs, if they don't work, the problem will almost always be the ballast. The exceptions to this are a loose wire in one of the sockets, or a loss of power to the fixture. But I would start with a new ballast. Even better, you can bypass the ballast and install LED tubes that don't use a ballast. But that would mean exchanging the new fluorescent tubes for LED tubes. I've watched a few videos on replacing the ballast, and I believe I'll be fine but it was working last night before the old bulbs went. How often is it that the ballast needs to be replaced? Some of those old T12 magnetic ballasts lasted for years and years. There are untold numbers of them still in use today. The new technology will be an electronic ballast. I don't think you can even find the magnetic ones available anymore. I have two sets of lights in the room, one is still working without issue. However, as a question of practicality, if I replace one ballast I presume it's a good idea to simply replace both, correct? Will I need to get different bulbs or will the F40T12 bulbs still work? I would go ahead and replace both ballasts, assuming they have the same number of hour of use on them. The electronic ballast may not drive a 40 watt T12, but they'll drive a 34 watt. The difference in lumens is not detectable to the human eye. Last question or two, I think, will this ballast work for the 40 watt? It says it will but I'm not always certain of these things. HTTPS colon slash www.homadepo.com slash p slash Philips Advance Omnistar 40 Watt 2 Lamp T12 Rapid Start High Frequency Electronic Replacement Ballast 520395202960408 Question mark Modal type equals drawer Is there a need to check the connections for the bulbs inside the fixture or will the ballast replacement be enough? That ballast has all of the proper specifications, so it should be fine. I would not check any connections to the socket until after the ballast is installed, and even then only if the bulbs don't come on. I appreciate the help. I'll go for broke with the ballast and see how we do. Thanks and a good rest of the day. Thank you. If the new ballasts don't resolve the issue, please reply here to let me know. Have a great weekend. If you have a home improvement or appliance question and want to chat with an expert now visit justanswer.com slash YTHI.